Hello friends, this video sequence and series part 2 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched sequence and series part 1. Now let's define series. We know sequence. Sequence is nothing but ordered list which has a pattern. In case of series, series is nothing but sum of sequence. So what we've got? Sequence is nothing but ordered list which has pattern and series is nothing but sum of sequence. It is denoted by the symbol summation, summation a k where k is equal to 1 to n that is we are adding number from 1 to n. So please note here, I will write once again, series is nothing but ordered list which has pattern, correct? This is sequence, sorry this is sequence. This is sequence. Sequence is nothing but ordered list which is pattern and series is nothing but sum of sequence. Please note, don't get confused. Sequence is ordered list of, or pattern. For example, when I say 1, 2, 3, 4, this is a series, this is a sequence. 1, 2, 3, 4 is an ordered list which is a pattern and the pattern here is the difference is 1. When I talk about series, series is sum of these numbers that is 1 plus 2, 3, 3 plus 3, 6 plus 4, 10. So this 10 is series that is 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4. So you got sequence is nothing but ordered list or pattern. Series is the sum of sequence. And if you want to denote series, you denote this by this symbol. This is called summation and you say AK k is equal to 1 to n this symbol is nothing but this means a1 k is equal to 1 you put plus a2 plus a3 plus a4 you keep adding it till a n because the maximum value of k is n and the minimum value of k is 1 so you keep adding value of k from 1 to n this is denoted by summation that is summation a k where k is equal to 1 to Thank you. Visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos, try free online tests, get the best quality study materials, study from the best tutors and mentors and much more. Thanks once again.